Hey guys, it's Rob here. Are you looking for a really easy way to add a vintage look to your footage in DaVinci Resolve? Today I'm going to show you how for free. So we're going to come to the site ineedeffects.com and this is where we're going to get the overlay that we're going to use. Now, like I said, this is for the free version. If you have the studio, it's so much easier. You can just add the effect straight in, but for the free version, we need separate footage that we can use. So come to ineedeffects.com. We're going to click search and then you can search something like grain, for example. And now you'll get a bunch of different effects and we're going to be adding these over the top of our footage. So choose one that you think will suit your video and the style that you're going for. Once you've decided on one, click on it and then simply click download file and it is that simple. I'm not affiliated with this site in any way and I get nothing from this site. This is just a really, really useful website for free video effects. Okay guys, so then you want to go ahead, open up DaVinci Resolve, import your media. So we've imported the overlay that we just downloaded and we've also imported the footage that we want to give the old effect. Drag into the timeline your footage and then we're going to go ahead and we're going to drag the overlay above it into a new timeline like this. You can also right click just here and click add track if you'd like to do that instead. So now if we press play, we can see the clip is above it, but we can't see the footage underneath. So what you want to do is select the overlay footage, the grain footage that we downloaded. Then we're going to come up to the right to the video tab, scroll down until you see composite, make sure you enable this box. Then we're going to click where it says normal and we're going to scroll down to where it says overlay. Now if we press play, you can see there is a old film effect added over the top. You can lower the opacity if you want it to be slightly less intense. You can also play around with the modes. So even though we used overlay, you can see if we go through, there are different modes and um, they might suit your footage better depending on what you're looking for. So just have a play around as I always recommend. So there you go, guys. That's a simple way to add an old vintage look to your videos in DaVinci Resolve. And I hope this was helpful. I'll catch you again very soon.